Traditionally, at the end of January, the allocation draw takes place in the new Eurovision host city. The allocation draw is the draw that determines which country is performing in which semi-final. We have decided to do this as a draw, both to increase the excitement, but because also we want to be fair. And we want to be fair to all the participating countries. The allocation draw for the 2019 Eurovision Song Contest was held in the Tel Aviv Museum of Art. It's important that we do this in, in a place that represents the city because we also have the host insignia here where the mayor from the previous host city is coming here to greet the mayor of this year's host city. Quite some preparation is needed before the draw takes place. We prepare a lot for the hosts. It is a bit complicated when you don't understand how the draw works and for many of these hosts it's the first time they are in contact with the Eurovision Song Contest. We use a lot of time talking to them how to make it light, understandable, easy for everyone to come on board and um, so, so we prepare a lot. Before 2013, the running order was also decided at a draw. Since the contest in Malmö, that changed. Some years ago, we decided not to draw the running order. This is because we think we can compose much better shows if we are able to make the, the running order as best as it can be. If you put up a grand TV show, you place the acts where they best can stand out, where they best can, can justify themselves uh, when it comes to, to tempo, when it comes to female, male, when it comes to single group. And I think if you uh, thoroughly look at it, I think we have managed to do that very well over the last years. To which semi-final are you looking forward to most? Let us know in the comments and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.